Want to change the color of parts or even all of your model just like this? everyone, I'm Alara, your stream sensei, and I'm here to show you how to alter the screen color for art meshes in BTube Studio. Let's get started. Altering the screen color for art meshes is super easy inside of BTube Studio. First, click on the menu, open the cogwheel, and head to the little person with the tiny cogwheel and click on Customize Model. From here, click on Customize Model and select Customize Multiple Screen Color for art meshes. Here, this menu is going to show you all the different layers in your model and which ones you can change. The selected layer will always light up in case you're unsure what you're about to change. You can also click on this little eye right here and will light up which part you're about to change too. Once you decide on what you want to change, go ahead and select the slider right here, which is going to bring up a new menu. In this menu, you're going to be able to change the color of whichever item that you highlighted. As you can see, my bang is already changing colors right here and you can change it to whatever you want by using the slider. The next menu is the screen menu, which also affects the coloration that you chose before. Sometimes you will need to slide both of the sliders in both menus to get the desired outcome effect or the color that you want. For today's example, I'm gonna be making more of a white skin look with black hair. Let me show you how it's done. And the nice part is once you've gotten one part to the right color that you want, you can continue to hit paste last multiply color and we'll go ahead and apply that exact same color to the new item that you selected. One of my favorite parts about doing this is seeing all the layers in your model. I think it's so cool. Now that we got the hair, makeup, and eyebrows the way that we want, I'm going to go ahead and change the skin color now. In this case, as you can see, the multiply menu doesn't really change the color of my ear. So I'm going to go ahead and go to the screen menu and change the color there. And ta-da! Just like that, we made a brand new look. Wow. Now every model will be different based off the layering and how everything is drawn. So make sure to go item by item and make sure that you get it the exact way that you want. Once you're done, I do recommend to hit the cogwheel. Go ahead and hit on the clipboard and create a new hotkey so that way you can toggle this new color setting whenever you want. Just hit the plus button hotkey action, art mesh color preset, and then hit record settings. This will keep count of how many art mesh things that you change on your model. You can also quickly assign a hotkey to toggle it off and on whenever you want. Thank you so much for tuning in, and I really hope you found this guide for changing art mesh colors inside VTube Studio super useful. If you have any questions or suggestions for future videos, please let me know in the comments down below. I can't wait to see all the colorful creations you guys create. See you soon, and bye-bye now.